Uh, hi. So this video, I wanted to show you how to use top on the big IP to show the uh, process, which process runs on which CPU core. So for example, if I run top here, uh, you can see here, uh, it shows the process, uh, but there is no column here to show, uh, for example, uh, on which CPU uh, this TMM.0 process runs on. So we can do that by say in this top window, uh, press uh, letter F, okay? So press letter F, and then we have uh, this uh, field management. And then here we have a, a capital P, uh, which shows the last used CPU. So let's uh, toggle this on by uh, press uh, space key. So now this uh, uh, P column field is turned on. Now let's press uh, escape and uh, then uh, press uh, capital W. Okay, so you can see it uh, right uh, top RC file uh, under the uh, root, under this root uh, directory. So this is, a, this is a top RC file we just uh, generated. And uh, uh, it look like this, right? So now let's run top again. And uh, uh, we can see here, now there is the, a column P field, uh, which shows the uh, CPU core ID uh, the process runs on, right? So TM0 on zero, and uh, alert D on core ID three or four, right? So then if we run a, a CBN1 a batch output, uh, so again, it will show the uh, process uh, ID, uh, the, the core ID the process runs on. For example, this Java, or MCPD on um, um, core three. Okay, so this is how you uh, use top uh, to show the core ID for the process. Okay, thank you.